the game to see the boxing boys. Speaking of inspiration and uh, people wanting to do great things, obviously Tyson Fury, uh, newly crowned champion, uh, definitely dethroned Vladimir Klitschko, but he had been saying that he was going to do this for a while. He had been such a, a, a cocky person, individual, very confident man, but another man just like himself is Deontay Wilder. Both of these guys, I mean, for two years now, social media battles, building up this fight, and uh, Tyson Fury came all the way from the United Kingdom and crashed the Barclays Center and made a big splash at Deontay Wilder's fight. Obviously, that is a fighter that fights on your network. Is there any interest in that super fight in the heavyweight division, which obviously is breathing new life into boxing? And uh, as a boxing fan, I really want that for all of us. Well, the heavyweight division is always a division of great interest and excitement and the old adage of so goes the heavyweight division as does boxing is one that I think we've seen not apply as much in recent years but it seems to be one that's coming back in a currency. We'll see what Tyson Fury's next moves are. Um, we're excited to talk with McKennessy, his promoter, and get in with his team and decide what move is next. Is HBO going to embrace the rematch clause with Tyson Fury and Vladimir Klitschko? Will we see that or? What we have to see is how far they get in terms of finalizing that. And once they're there with it, then we'll uh, dive in. Well, Peter, thank you for your time. And we uh, can't wait to see what's new with HBO this year under your helm. Thanks so much. Appreciate thank it. You.